Hi guys, you welcome back to my channel. I'm happy to be here with you today with another gist. Yes, yesterday was a heroic when Nigeria defeated the host Australia in the ongoing so uh, in the ongoing women World Cup. And I'm talking about the assistant Oshola, one of the scorers yesterday. But before we go into that, I'd like to appreciate you for coming to this channel to watch my video. If you are here for the first time, kindly subscribe to the channel and then press the notification bell so that you'll be notified each time I post new videos. I also want to appreciate all my subscribers, both new and returning subscribers. Thank you so much for your support. I sincerely appreciate your effort and your support. Thank you very much. So let's go back to the news I'm sharing at the moment and what this is all about. Asisat, Asisat Oshola of Super Falcons says her father is not happy with her celebration. Nigeria Asisat Oshola has opened up about our shirtless celebration following a brilliant goal against Australia at the Lang Park Stadium yesterday made her father unhappy. Asisa became the first African player to score at three editions of the FIFA Women's World Cup. After defeating Australia by three goals to one, I mean to two, in the ongoing competition. Oshola, who started the game on the bench but was introduced in the second half when the match was at 1 1, changed the direction of the game after scoring a spectacular goal in the 72nd minute, making her yank off her shirt, remove her shirt to celebrate the fate. So, speaking about the singular heart, Oshola noted that her father was unhappy with her choice of celebration, but added that life was a collection of unpredictable moments. Mm. She was sharing photos from the match through her Instagram page. My dad is definitely not happy with my choice of celebration. But then again, life is a collection of moments. And how would you lie? Great moments like that. Where I sincerely understand where the father is coming from. And I'm sure also that uh, people will also understand with her sister because she was so full of emotion and happiness and she couldn't control herself. So she removed her shirt, ran the, running around the field in celebration of the goal. Well, if a man does that, that is, you know, acceptable for, but for a lady, a lot of question mark. So, but life still goes on. Life still goes on. At least she knows now that her father is not in support of that kind of celebration. And I'm sure that she will caution herself next time. You know, the choice of celebration she should do when big moments like that come away in life. All right, and uh, I think this is the first time I will ever see her doing that in any celebration, even in club level, club level where she plays. She plays with the uh, Barcelona Women Football Club in Spain. I don't think I've ever seen her be celebrating that way. Anyway, the joy is that Nigeria won yesterday, and they are preparing for their sec their the last group match. With uh, uh, with with a British team, national British team, and the uh, Republic of Ireland, to be specific. I hope that uh, they will be able to secure their place in the second round. They only need a draw for them to qualify for round sixteen of the FIFA. Women World Cup 
Friends, if you have anything to say concerning this, your opinions are welcome. Let me know what you have to say about the father's reaction and about uh, uh, Assistant Oshua last celebration in yesterday's March. All right, thank you very much. I'll be so glad if you can make your comments known for people to see. Perhaps people will like to see it and we all like to learn from that too. Okay, friends, that is all about what I've come to share with you at the moment. I hope you enjoy this uh, video. Take good care of yourself. Be the best you can at every moment. Be sure to be the best you can. Till I come your way next time. Bye. Bye.